Hi, I'm Seamus Broca. I'm an application engineer at Tektronix, and today I want to show you a few things about our new IsoView probe, IsoView Gen 2. So to help demonstrate this, I have this DC to DC converter board that has two identical circuits. This board happens to be using gallium nitride power fets from EPC, but the concepts are the same for silicon carbide or silicon-based designs. What I'm measuring is both the gate to source voltage and the drain to source voltage of both the low side and the high side. For the low side measurements, I'm using a couple passive probes. And for the high side measurements, I'm using some low attenuation differential probes. So for the first comparison, here I'm showing the VGS measurements on the low side and the high side. On the high side, you can vaguely tell what's going on. But when I turn on IsoView, it's very obvious there's a clear Miller plateau and a small amount of ringing until it settles at 5 volts. There's also some interesting behavior at the opposite edge. You can see it looks like both gates are turned on at the same time, which is obviously bad for shoot through. But with IsoView, you can tell it's a lot less exaggerated. So it may or may not be a problem, but IsoView shows you more accurately. ICBU is very useful for any power converter design, like switch mode power supplies, three-phase motor drives, or any other application where common mode interference is a problem. For more information, check out tech.com, and thank you for watching.